I'm still at home. I uh, have everything locked into the, or uh, put into the um, truck bed. <clears throat> so, if you guys want to really see how my yard is, um, I've had offers for certain trees in my yard. Uh, <laughs> here, check this out. So, as you can see, this is a bougainvillea, uh, Thailand bougainvillea. Uh, more compact in leaves. Uh, if you look, the way how I arranged everything, very nice bald spots because I was cleaning it out. After my Philippine trip, I had to take out all the wild branches that were crossing. So if you look at the branch arrangement, there's ba barely anything crossing each other now. So, yeah. I have all these smaller ones too here. As you can see. And then for this one, these are my soon-to-be bonsai. I have I've been growing it into the ground for over 10 years now. Um, so far, I got the sh shape of the trunk that I need. Um, same thing like with that Japanese black pine. I got the shape that I need, so I'll be wiring it up and hopefully getting it into a pot soon. Here's another um, Thailand bougainvillea. You can see the branch work arrangement. This one I kind of skeletoned it out, um, so you can see how the the buds are sprouting for the new leaves. Um, yeah, nothing should be crossing. Uh, basically, it's like the bonsai art form, so replica of a massive tree. Um, and so, the way how I did it was basically tie down the branches. Um, you can actually use green rope to conceal it more, um, or some weighted kind of device or bamboo. But uh, this is my method of what I I've done. And then you can see all my other bonsai that I'll be transferring over so not bad huh? Okay. But now heading to Juan Memorial Park. 